Paul Grayson back again with another video. We're looking at WTF1. It's been a while since we did a wee video on WTF1, but we're not really mentioning P1 with Matt and Tommy today. Of course, it is the 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 wheel night wars or whatever some people want to call it, right? But WTF1 has resorted to desperate measures. I mean, it's been what a couple of months now since they've decided to, uh, I mean, since Matt and Tommy left, and they've decided to hire a bunch of Nuggets, and already they've replaced them, because look, desperate times. So during the Australian Grand Prix, they were doing a bunch of live streams, and basically, they've just started scrapping everyone that they've got. So they did a show called The Big F1 Questions at the 2023 F1 Australian Grand Prix with Break F1. I have no idea who this guy is. He's he's wearing specs. He kind of looks like the Cal guy who used to do the, the podcast with uh, Arava about eight fucking years ago. Probably more, is it about eight? Probably more than eight years ago, wherever they did it. Um, so yeah, another reek of desperation. They've already gave up on the people they brought in. Like, yes, I know in this video, right, you've got him who's a part of the show, right? But then in this video... You know, you've got 2023 F1 Australian Grand Prix winners and losers with Josh Ravel. Who I've seen a couple of his videos. He's alright, like, but I mean the height team is this wee cartoon circle, yellow circle. And that isn't exactly uh filling anybody with an awful lot of confidence, is it, if we're being honest, uh, this guy. But I mean like if you just look at their fuse, their fuse are done, man. What I mean the over a million subs, man, right? And look at look at look at their fuse here. 3.9, 5.313. And look, they're like so the race after a race like that, they haven't even uploaded a fed. They've just did two live streams about it. That's just that that's just not good enough, man. The fuse are diabolical. Uh and these guys, man, these guys are reeking and the I mean they know exactly what they're doing. Because I mean, look at that, right? They could never been able to upload that to WTF1. They were just uploading their singular reaction to uh, the uh, the last lap shootout, or the, the two last lap shootouts that we got. Uh, Alonso got took out the Alpines. Stroll going straight on, all that good stuff. So yeah, they're making a lot of money. I'm sure they're happy. They quit their job to do they, they, they their own channel, and I quit my job, so I'm loving life. But until then, peace.